Hello guys, in today's video we're gonna check out the best art board in this year. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I've tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability and many more. To find out more information about these dartboard you can check out the description below. If you want to get a best quality dartboard according to your needs, then watch the video till the end and then decide to buy. At the first position of our list, we have Windmill Blade 5. Windmill is synonymous with high quality craftsmanship, so just by name alone, you should know what to expect from this bristle board. The Blade 5 has been one of the best selling dartboards since its introduction. When you choose the Blade 5, you are choosing high quality with a distinctive design and consistently superb performance. Another fantastic feature to note is the fact that, like all modern windmill boards, the Blade 5 comes with the Rotolock triple wheel mounting system that allows for easy mounting to any wall. All in all, you simply cannot go wrong with the Blade 5. This is a top tier professional dartboard that will serve both pros and casual players alike. The British darts organization seems to agree, as it currently endorses professional use of the Blade 5. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Windmill Blade 5 Dual Core. An evolution of the best-selling Blade 5 dartboard, we have another superb offering from Wimow. But, how does the Blade 5 Dual Core differ from the standard model? What does it offer that makes it a worthwhile addition to your wall? The Blade 5 Dual Core boasts the same reduced angle wiring as the standard model Blade 5. That means that the Dual Core also possesses a not insignificant 30-degree angle reduction in wiring thickness. As a result, each double section is 9mm2 larger, and each triple section an impressive 6mm2 larger. The dual core solution means that your board lasts for much longer. In other words, dual cores make this new Blade 5 substantially more durable than the single core model. Every other feature of the Blade 5 dual core is shared between models. So, as the bottom line, the single core model will be good for most but the dual core will last you longer and is a better bang for your buck. The number 3 position is held by Unicorn Eclipse HD2. From Unicorn, we get one of the best dartboards on the market, the Unicorn Eclipse HD2. The Eclipse HD2 is special because it has been designed to be one of the slickest and cleanest looking dartboards available. For example, Unicorn decided to paint the number ring a deep black, using bright white numbers for extra visual contrast. Following this trend, the board has been cleaned up to facilitate the player's attention and focus through the removal of all legs of the spider ring. As such, the Eclipse HD2 from Unicorn is one of the cleanest and sleekest looking boards on the market. As with all other modern dartboards, the Eclipse HD2 has focused on reducing the thickness of its wiring. The result? It now boasts thinner wires and a 14% increase in playable area over previous iterations. This is a professional quality bristle dartboard. It offers a seamless playing surface area that is tournament ready. Next at number 4 we have Unicorn Eclipse Pro 2. While the Unicorn Eclipse HD2 is a fantastic dartboard, the Unicorn Eclipse Pro 2 aims to raise the bar. If you have seen any televised PDC tournaments, chances are you have seen these boards in action. The Unicorn Eclipse HD2 is the definitive bristle dartboard for tournament play. It has been fine-tuned to allow for maximum playing efficiency and player comfort. The highest grade sisal fibers make the Eclipse Pro 2 highly durable and self-healing making it a perfect board for heavy play. All the numbers are metal and painted with a high contrast paint that increases visibility and eases eye strain over extended game sessions. The box comes with a highly convenient unilock leveling system, which allows you to set up the board on most surfaces with ease. The number 5 position is held by Viper Shot King. The Shot King by Viper is proof that high-quality products do not have to cost an arm and leg. The Shot King Bristle Board is a very inexpensive board that provides users with substantial value by managing to be greater than the sum of its parts. While the Viper Shot King will not knock the competition in any one category, it does manage to provide us with a solid package that is worth considering, especially if you're running on a budget. One minor downside of Viper Shot King is its use of staples to hold the wiring of the scoring sectors. This practice is quite common among the lower end of the price spectrum, so it comes as no surprise. However, this means that, on average, the Shot King will cause more bounce outs than other similar boards that forego using staples. All in all, the Shot King by Viper is a great budget board that provides great value, especially as an entry board for beginners. 
The number 6 position is dominated by Viper Razorback. If you are looking for a Viper dartboard that is a step up, the Razorback is a good option. Viper offers a solid entry point dartboard with their Shock King model, but the Razorback aims to elevate the bar. The way Viper improved their Razorback was to develop their weak points and reinforce what was already working. For example, one of the Shock King's weakest points was the inclusion of staples to hold the spire. The Razorback is a completely stable free dartboard. This means that it causes significantly fewer bounce outs from hits on bulging staples. One final feature worth mentioning is that this time around, Viper has made the removable number ring from a low glare material. So, no matter where you hang your Razorback, you will have a cleaner look. The result? Extreme durability in a board that can withstand the test of time, even after thousands of games. The Viper Razorback is good enough for official tournaments, so, if you're one of the casual players looking for a worthy board to use at home, this is one you should consider. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Viper Chroma. The dartboard market is crowded and, let's be honest, for the most part, quite boring. There are dozens of products, and many of them are virtually identical. That is why GLD has introduced a new and exciting addition to the Viper family of products. The Viper Chroma. The Viper Chroma dartboard offers the same high-quality build and craftsmanship we have come to expect from the Viper line of products, such as a high-grade sizzle fiber core that has fantastic self-healing capabilities. It also boasts highly galvanized triangular spider wire and a staple-free bullseye for optimum play and reduced chance of bounce-outs. But what makes this bad boy more fun than the countless other dartboards in the game is its color scheme. The Viper Chroma features a coating with high-definition colors that are both bold and bright, and there are no other dartboards like it. Its galaxy black, cerulean, and emerald screen printing will look beautiful hanging on any wall or wooden cabinet. The number 8 position is held by Noter Superwire 2. Noter is, without a doubt, one of the most trusted brands in the world of darts. Their products are consistently endorsed by the world's leading darts organizations, and the Supwire 2 dartboard is no exception. The Noter Supwire 2 Sissel dartboard is a fantastic option, from the pub to the man cave. This regulation size board offers the complete package. As for the durability of the board, the Noter Supwire 2 is made using high grade Sissel fiber, so expect excellent healing and dart retention. This is, of course, fantastic news when you consider that the Noter Supwire 2 features an increased target area. This is not a board that will break down on you after a few months of play. Even the most hardcore and avid veterans can get a long useful life out of this bad boy. Noter is so confident that the Supwire 2 is a top tier product that they have included a full year warning against any defects. Next at number 9 we have TG Champion Tournament Bristle Dartboard. Look, the Wimmel Blade 5 and most other dartboards are not expensive by any means. But if you've never played darts before and just want to give it your best shot, the TG Champion is quite a bit cheaper and good enough for someone getting started. It's less than half the price and branded as a tournament dartboard, which I'd say is a massive stretch but nonetheless, the board is better than 95% of what you'll find at your local Walmart or even on Amazon. Going through online reviews you'll see a few people complaining about the bullseye being too hard to stick on the TG Champion, but this is not true. The odds are high that people are using cheap plastic darts not made for bristle boards and then blaming the board. You'll be better off investing in a set of Tungsten steel tip darts. Not only will they stick better but having darts with proper weight and optimized flights will make a huge difference in your aim. Overall, this is a really solid choice for most people but if you don't have budget concerns, you can get a fair bit more quality and longevity out of the Blade 5. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Viper Hudson Sissel slash Bristle Steel Tip Dartboard and Cabinet Bundle. If you're going to go with the Viper Dartboard, it's worth the extra money to go for the Cabinet Bundle. The anchor for this is the Shock King Bristle Board which, as mentioned above, is good quality. But again you run into the problem with the spider being too thick, encouraging bounce outs. If you're looking to train yourself to only aim for the center of a scoring section and don't mind a lot of frustration, the Hudson Sissel might be the way to go but it will still be a bit annoying. The darts that come with the set are much higher quality than I've come to expect with starters like this. Not great, but certainly good enough for the average player. I probably wouldn't keep them if I was very serious about darts, but if I just want a game to play with friends, they are fine. It's almost a better approach to buy the cabinet, than get a better dart board. We're looking to replacement spider with thinner wire which won't cause as many bounce outs. 
That's all for today. We upload all types of sports product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.